American eclipse, it was quite a sight. Now we're learning it's had an impact on vision through eyes and camera lenses. Western Mass News reporter Olivia Hickey had her eye on the issue today, and she joins us live after getting answers on those concerns. Olivia. Chris, if your eyes were impacted, the good news is you will likely be fine. If there was damage, it would have happened by now. As for your phone's camera, you could be out of luck. The Great American Eclipse was quite the sight on Monday, with just over 93% of the sun covered by the moon in Western Mass. Many were quick to look up with and without protective eyewear. As a result, Forest Park Eye Care had numerous inquiries on Tuesday. We've had quite a few people call just with some lingering effects, uh, headaches, light sensitivity, tearing, dry eyes. Some people have had some vision uh, that was blurred for three to four hours, um, some for 12, but almost all of them have gone away. Dr. Tracy Harridan tells Western Mass News Others may not be so lucky. Unfortunately, the people who looked at it too long and, and would have gotten some damage uh, is permanent. But most people can't look at the sun or the eclipse for that long anyways. But warnings about eye damage were not the only ones ignored. You can damage your camera sensor on your on your phone. Stan Prager from Go Geeks in East Long Meadow says, like eyes, a camera can only handle so much. Uh, your phone will handle like, you know, you take a sunset or a sunrise or something like that. Just like if you're glancing at a sunset or a sunrise, right? But to stare at the sun is dangerous. He explains the damage done to a camera is irreversible and your phone will likely need to be replaced. How will you know if the sensor is damaged? when you take other pictures. If it does not take a good picture or it is, you know, focusing on the wrong part of the picture or it's distorted. Now for the next eclipse in the next few decades or so, Prager does share some advice on how you could take a picture and avoid damaging another phone. You're just going to need your iPhone, a pair of eclipse glasses and some tape. What you're going to do is line up the camera and the phone, make sure that's all aligned, and you're just gonna put it there, tape it to make sure it's in place so you have a good filter so your phone is protected. But he does remind you, if you are gonna use this trick, be sure to wear a pair of Eclipse glasses on your face to avoid that damage to your eyes. Reporting in studio, Olivia Hickey, Western Mass News. Olivia, thank you. We'll try and remember for 2044.